Welcome back. More good news for the public health care system. A government-led pharmacist training program aiming to build capacity in the public sector is yielding results. Ten newly trained and certified pharmacists are now back in the Bahamas and deployed at various public health centers. They are great help, to be honest with you. And to but elderly persons, of course, they are very happy to see new faces. That's lead pharmacist at the South Beach Community Health Center, Londa Taylor, extolling the difference her new complement of pharmacist interns have already made. These three pharmaceutical wonders are among the first to take part in a revolutionary certification program introduced at the College of the Bahamas four years ago. Health Minister Dr. Perry Gomez says while there is no shortage of pharmacists in the private sector, it's been hard to attract professionals to the public service for the usual reason, money. Because people make very good salaries in the private sector, all the trained pharmacists leave the government sector and go into the private sector. And so this program was geared to try and train more people in a, and have training in country so that we could get the numbers of kinds of numbers of pharmacists that the country needs. Assistant Hospital Administrator Gina Carey says these pioneering interns now hold a Bachelor's of Science in Pharmacy, the two-year balance of the four-year training taking place at the University of Technology in Jamaica. They're doing a rotation throughout the um, public health sector clinics. They are rotating one month at each facility, which includes pretty much all of the public health polyclinics and um, Sandlin's Rehabilitation Center and the Princess Market Hospital. Pharmacists Shantia Heal, Quandria Johnson, and Latanya Pinder are all grateful for the opportunity to pursue their passion at home and in the Caribbean. They share the benefits of their new skills with us. But the experience here in the Bahamas has afforded me, first and foremost, the opportunity of getting my education at home. Therefore, I was able to stay with family and then go off. To Lee, I'm pretty much hoping to um, bring a new level of patient care in our government sector. We want to work along with our multifaceted um, medical community, our doctors, our nurses, and providing top care, individ individualized patient, patient care. I've been in the job for like for four weeks now and it's very different from what I've experienced in Jamaica. It has a different clientele and you get more interaction with more patients. 